Hey guys, Whiskers back here with a new video. So in today's video, I am going to be talking about the downfall of Vanilla Earth. As all of you know, or most of you should know, um, Vanilla Earth is shutting down. And that announcement was not a joke, it was dead serious. The reason for the shutdown is a bit unfortunate, but you know, I have to say I'm, I'm glad that Souls is doing something better now, and that is, he's doing football, you know, in American sling, it's soccer, and it, he got he got into a, um, a team that is paying him a hell of a lot more, and he's also going to be the leader of that team, so he's not, he, he's not going to be on, like, anymore. And that, that is bad because he's the main guy who funds the server. Like, he has all the funding. So, anyways, like, BE was bound to die anyways. I think it was best for Souls to leave now. Because, like, the only reason why I stayed so long is because of Souls. Like, I would have left so long ago if Souls didn't convince me to come back, like, multiple times. And that's why you guys seen me leave and join back, like, Four times during this whole time because Souls made me leave on multiple occasions. Not only Souls, just like the other staff too that he wanted to keep. It was just like, it was just a whole jumble mess, you know? Like, nothing was organized, nothing was. It, it was a mess. It, it was truly a mess. On top of that, with how Weston. Weston released the last, the last season so damn poorly that, that Souls ended up convincing me to come back because how bad it was. Like, I was debating, then I'm like, then I looked at it, I mean, dude, I logged on, it was TNT, everyone had TNT, I spawned, someone was spawned in like a hundred withers, I mean, if I still have the clip, I'll play it right now, but it was, it was really bad. Wesson released that so poorly. I'm disappointing, but, disappointing, I'm disappointed, but honestly, like, I can't blame, I can't blame him fully, I did give him the server kind of, like, wacky to begin with, but, like, I don't know, that, that was just, just bad. That was bad. That was bad, bad. Anyways, regardless, it is what it is, you know? Now, this is kind of a segue to my next topic, you know? I am planning to make a new server, a new network. I, I already created a Discord that I still need to organize more, but for the most part, the Discord is done. Um... Link link for the Discord is down below, right? You guys can join if you guys want to join me on the journey of making this new server. The Hardcore Life Still spin-off, I'm still going to make that. That's the first thing I'm going to make. Hopefully it comes out this month. Right? That's that's the plan. If it will come out this month. I, I'm talking to do two developers as of now to help me make the main plugin for that server. Um... It it is also going to be cosplay too with Bedrock players, so I'm really excited to see where that server goes. And as of an Earth server, I don't plan on making another another Earth server. To be honest, like I really do not plan on doing so. But but if you guys really want me to make a Earth server and actually dedicate my time making an Earth server, then I will. You know. I will. But other than that, I do not believe I will be making Earth Super. I mean, like, personally, in my opinion, it's dead. Like, after PE, I don't think any, any of us can recover from that. I mean, it looks bad on me. It looks bad on all the other staff who was with, with us. Mainly the devs, not really staff, who helped me make the server. It it was unfortunate. It was a mix of me not never having time to make the server and souls randomly promoting, demoting random people that I needed. Like, did I? Multiple people helped me throughout the journey, and souls just like made them quit or whatever. It, it it was a mess. It was a truly a mess. But in this new server, if any of the older staff from VE join me on this journey. Just note that your worlds will be changed. I mean, like, I think I'm going to start all the, everyone I help with besides admins are going to be moderators. 
And for the, re for the reason for this is because I feel as though no one is, like, no one in our staff team is qualified for the world they have. I mean, like, and not, no offense to the managers or anything. They, they hardly do anything. The admins hardly do anything. And, yes, there's nothing for them to do, and that's the whole point. Like, there's, there is nothing for them to do, so why even have them, you know? I think that's the main reason why I'm doing that. Well, it is kind of the main reason why I'm doing that. There's also many other minor things that I'm just going to discard because I don't, I'm not, I'm not going to get into that way. But if you guys would love to, I, I, my plan, my goal personally is try to build this discord up at least 30 people, you know, 30 people join the journey. That's my hope. Or yeah, that's mainly my hope. At least 30 people join. And from there, we build up a community from there. Whoever joins within the next two weeks will get a OG wink role in the Discord. So, you know, in the future, if the server ever takes off, people will know that you've been here from the very beginning. And, you know, I don't know, it's just like a nice little thing to have. Kind of like what we did in, um, with this, with the last feed Discord. Ah, there's the kids talking in the background. They always disrupt me. Disrupt me. Um, yeah, that's uh, that's my main plan. It's unfortunate. Vanilla Earth is dead for good. Um, I was gonna try to revive it again. I was gonna try to revive it again, honestly, but I don't know. There's so much negativity behind BE in its like hole that there's no. I don't really feel like continuing it. On top of that, like like I said before, everything is so disorganized. I want to start on a blank page. Starting on a blank page where we have a strong foundation, it's going to set us up for way better greatness for what to what is to come, you know? So, yeah, I I am truly excited to see this new server come together. Like I know with the white foundation what I'm trying what I'm trying to do now and yeah, with the white foundation, the white staff, the white devs. I'm no longer going to have devs that just configs cuz that was a huge thing in P. Every single dev only knew how to config and they acted like the complete boss. Like they acted like they know they knew everything. And you all simp for them so hard, and that's the only reason why they win for HB, Clay, and some others. I don't even know the name, but those are the main two that you guys simped over so hard. And that's the only reason why we had them for so long. They, they only knew how to config. They didn't know how to do more than most of the staff. It was kind of sad. Um, regardless, regardless, um, yeah. New server, it's gonna be great. Hopefully, we can build up this huge um, community. Or well, it's not gonna be as big as BE once once was for a while. But I, I hopefully, my plan is to get some advertising um, people who can advertise as well when the server comes up. And yeah, I don't know. That's just the main basis of this video. I had to start to make a quick video. Um, this is like the third retake but in the, like the past 20 minutes. So yeah. Um, that would be all for today, guys. Thank you, folks, for listening in. Um, this has been Whiskers. Um, I, I truly hope you guys all have an amazing day, and I truly hope to see you all in a new Discord. I am so excited to get this started. It's going to be a... A hefty project, none, none than less. Anyways, this has been Whiskers. I'll see you all in the next one. Peace out.